August with the shade. They said they ain't want no more op makeup. So. Hey yo. What's good, Shady Gang? Welcome back to another show with August with the Shade. Listen, go ahead and grab your cups, because you already know I'm about to spill the tea, and y'all know I keep the shade. <laughs> now, today's video is going to be about how Megan Thee Stallion played everybody. Let's get into the tea. Who would have ever thought that Megan Thee Stallion would be exposed by her own man? It is so crazy when the guy that you sleep with is the guy that is coming out here telling everybody about your business. I mean, how does he not know your business when he was sleeping next to you for two or, for two or three years, right? I mean, Partisan Fontaine is not one of somebody that I'm fond of because, I, you know, I don't get with anybody that ever made a song, a, a, a rhyme, or anything towards Nicki Minaj. Um, I'm not really a fan of Partisan, you feel me? But what Partisan did is very commendable, and I'm going to tell you why. Because a lot of people have been looking at the Cobra lady like she was just some girl that went to college, you know what I'm saying? She's some round away girl. She don't really have her parents and stuff like that. She's going through a lot. Um, um, and you know a lot of people they kind of they kind of banded with her with that especially with, with the protect black women stuff you know what i'm saying like the whole thing that went down with her in 2020 um i mean everybody was on megan's side because they really thought that megan the stallion had a story they thought megan the stallion was you know what i'm saying being real being truthful but the guy that you are messing with that you were messing with says that as soon as he pops out with his new girlfriend here you are being mad and you're you, th you literally you went on cobra and you started this <laughs> megan you started this but before I get into what Partisan had to say, I want to just take a little ride back real quick. Isn't this everything that Nicki Minaj told y'all? Isn't this everything that she literally said in the songs, like seeing green about Megan Thee Stallion and her and, 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 and the whole AAA thing and how she's been messing with everybody? I mean, Nicki said this, but every time I go on the internet and I see, you know, once Nicki said something about Megan Thee Stallion or even in the, even in the Red Ruby The Sleeve song, Nicki Minaj kind of told y'all about how she was going to be getting exposed very, very soon and stuff like that, right? But nobody believed Nicki Minaj. When Nicki said that she said this stuff about her child before she, before he was even born, nobody believed her. They thought that Nicki was just trying to start stuff, but Nicki been trying to tell y'all that Megan was funny acting. And that's why Megan, that's why Nicki got away from Megan Thee Stallion a long time ago. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's literally said that she talks about everybody. So she talks about Cardi B. She talks about all of these people. So that is the reason why in my opinion, Cardi and Megan comes out with this little fake friendship because they know that they be talking about each other behind the scenes. They only doing this for public for publicity. You feel me? But let's run back into this, right? So Partisan Fontaine comes out and basically talks about Megan, posting pictures as if she's been in the gym. You know what I'm saying? Working on her body, and you know, but it's not the truth. You know what I'm saying? She went. They said she went and got lipo. Allegedly, they're, they've been saying a lot of things about Megan Thee Stallion, and a lot of people have been not believing it because Megan is a beautiful girl. Megan is a likable girl, but. What is it that we're going to believe, y'all? When are we going to stop believing these people when they say that these people are a certain type of way? Like, Megan has proved to me that everything that he said in this song is absolutely true. And I'm going to tell you right now, I love I love my black women. I love y'all. But y'all can't get down on this man for coming out and telling his truth because she started it first. She literally started this with him first. So he has every right to come out and speak his truth. It's not fair. Tory Lanez is, is going away. He can't even speak his truth. So it is left up to a man named Partisan Fontaine who went at the baby, he went at Tory, who went at everybody who he thought was messing with his girlfriend and come to find out he, she was really messing with these people for real for real even lying and saying that she was on an island getting you know what i'm saying getting some you know health and healing but she was actually with another man you know what i'm saying so listen y'all gotta understand that these people they gotta spill this is he's a rapper and being a rapper you know what i'm saying i think that it is really really good for you to come out and put it out this way instead of going on twitter and, and making posts about it posting receipts no you go and make a song so that everybody can listen to it and then if y'all can take whatever y'all want to from it because if y'all don't believe him then that's on y'all but the facts are in the pudding you can literally see you know her her, her moves and how everything goes just by watching the actions that she has you know portrayed throughout the years you feel what i'm saying nikki was not wrong y'all nikki minaj was right about this girl the whole time and i feel like we need to start opening our eyes and start realizing that these people are not who they say they are okay but i want to know what y'all think about partisan's little uh this to make and will it actually go somewhere who knows <laughs> like the video subscribe to the youtube channel y'all i'm out i'm not even a man and got my in their mouth <laughs> <laughs> i was thinking about y'all oh here we go august with the shade talking about who we swinging on tonight why y'all got 